I am so tired, but we have training, so we have to get up and get going. Today is Saturday and we're going to spend the weekend together, so we have to be in the club for after 7 o'clock and then we have like meetings and straight into training and then we should be finishing training up around 11 I think. I have to look at the schedule again, but we're going to spend the weekend together and obviously when I go to training I won't be able to show everything. I might only get a quick glimpse of things because it's pretty much straight in, get your activations, get everything done before we have meetings and straight into training. So I'll bring you along with me for the rest of the weekend anyway. And we're gonna go and get ready to go. Fit check, so just ready for training. Also guys, I got my hair done the other day, so I'm back like fully brunette. It feels so much like healthier, but it's taking me a little bit of time to get used to, but I am just ready for training and getting a coffee on the way. Gonna, I have overnight Weedabix med so I can eat that once I get into training and then it will be go time. So we have our overnight Weedabix ready to go. If you wanna know the recipe, you can check out my Instagram or it's on my last video on YouTube, but this is ready to go and I'll have this as soon as I get into the club. We have got the goods and now it is time to go into the club and get our done. So I'm just in the door from training. It was a pretty big session. I got my recovery done, had a protein bar and a yogurt there afterwards. And I'm going to go get a coffee with my sister now in like a half an hour. I have a little bit of work to do and get back to some clients. So I'm gonna do that now. And then I'll go for a coffee with my sister, come back again and get ready because we're going for dinner. We're going to this really nice restaurant. So I'll bring you along with me. It's apparently so good and the vibes are amazing so we love that but I have a few clients to get back to now gonna do that and then get my second caffeine hit for the day I just appreciate how nice it is outside my apartment block like look at the pool I am back from getting a coffee with my sister and I just did more work there so now i'm gonna make myself something for lunch now i don't actually have any bread or anything so i might have like a bowl of oats with some yogurt and stuff so i can get like a bit of carbs and protein and then i'm going out for dinner this evening so i don't want to eat too much because i actually want to enjoy my dinner but i'm gonna go make something now and then it is time to get ready this is my oats that i'm just gonna have now oats salted caramel yogurt blueberries and melted biscoff i have literally been having these oats consistently for like months and i'm still not sick of it and i don't know how i'm just the type of person that can like eat the same thing and not get sick of it now i do like change up my recipes and stuff sometimes but i honestly just love this and i have it like every day let's have my makeup done there i just did the quickest makeup look ever next up oh i don't know whether to do hair or outfit. I know depending on the outfit then you can change your hair but I think I'm just going to put a few curls in my hair and then we'll put the outfit together after. I'm still trying to get used to the, like the darker hair. I don't know how I'm feeling. It's taking me a little bit longer than I thought but hopefully like when I'm all dressed up. I don't have any tan on though because I'm not tan until tomorrow because we have photo day on Monday. Got a tan for that but when I have my outfit and stuff on I kind of hope I'm like vibing my hair. These are my new jeans I got. I love the kind of like acidy wash color of them, if you can see. Now, obviously I'm wearing a gym top and a sports bra, so we're gonna change that. But I was thinking, I got these two tops the other day, like very basic. They're like the Skims dupe. But I was thinking maybe like the black or white. I didn't bring much jackets out with me, like I'm very limited in my jackets. This black leather one or maybe the brown. Although it's not that cold for the brown, so I'm not sure, but let me see. If I went black on black, or is it better to like have, oh, I think that's better. 
Right, we're going to try the white with the black jacket and then either my New Balance or my dogs. So let me go get changed and I'll show you. The white one, I, I actually hate these type of tops because I feel it makes my shoulders look absolutely huge. Like I look like, no, I can't do that, okay. I need to cover this up. I'm aware I need to take off the tags too. For While I'm here at my jeans, these are Glassons jeans and they're literally the only jeans I can buy that's a size 10 that actually fits me. Whereas if I buy a size, I generally have to buy like a size 12 in jeans because um, of my quads, like the tens just won't go up. This is what we're dealing with. I can't actually see myself. My mirror is behind the camera, like that way. So I can't even see what this is like. Right, shoes time. Could be a vibe, but these 1960s are like the most comfy shoes ever. If I don't like this though, I need to see if I actually like this. I feel like I'm trying to make something happen and it's just not like, it's just not suiting me. So I don't know, I feel like I could do a full 360 and change, but this is our fit. But the dunks, because I feel like the white and black just tie in good together. And yeah, now I need to go text my sister and see where she is at. This is my outfit. I actually nearly forgot to put on my jewelry. So I have these on. Also I got my nails done the other day and then I have these rings and just a little Ashling necklace. That is me ready to go. I also got makeup on my top, which we love. Like, of course, I buy anything white, cream, anything like that, and I always spill something or just, I destroy it. I just can't have white clothes. Like, I'm so bad with whites and creams. Anyway, I'm gonna go meet my sister now. We're gonna jump on the tram, go straight into the city, just go for a stroll and then dinner is at 5.45 and I cannot wait. I am so excited to try it. With my sissy. This is Hosier Street. Like how cool. Unsuccessful day shopping, but we're absolutely starving, so we're going to go to dinner. Honestly, so tired. My legs are dead. The drag that I have to get Mona to link her up to me. Pull me up the hill and help me. She missed me so much. No, she missed me more. No, she missed me no, more. She missed no. me more. We're literally just finished dinner and my god it was divine delicious like the cauliflower we got in the like start it was like basically like cauliflower chicken wings like the buffalo sauce but 10 out of 10 recommend daughter-in-law it's on little burke street in the city and unbelievable 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 we did the feed me menu as well and i definitely recommend that as well because it like gave us things that we probably wouldn't have ordered and also and then, free yeah. with refills on it so yeah you so, get, if you like something in particular like your butter chicken or whatever they refill it for free more rice. on your main courses so they give you like a selection of different like um curries in the main section and then if you like one or like your rice and stuff you can ask them for more because we got extra rice um, and bread and, and butter bread. chicken <laughs> we are just back in from dinner and we're gonna relax mona's on the tea here and we're gonna make some tea, relax, watch a movie for the night, and then I'll catch you all tomorrow and I'll bring you along with me for my Sunday. I have just showered, brushed my teeth, did my skincare, and now I'm ready for bed. I have Pilates booked in the morning, but my hamstring just isn't feeling 
it's best so i might cancel on that and just take it easy tomorrow good morning it is sunday it is just after 7 a.m and i've actually been awake a little while but i am supposed to go to pilates at nine i just don't know if i'll go because i'm a bit conscious of my hamstring it was a bit sore yesterday so i don't want to annoy it i think i'm gonna go to a coffee shop and like bring my laptop and stuff and do some work like in a coffee shop close to where pilates is and then i can make up my mind closer to the time i'm gonna get up now make my bed get ready and then grab my laptop and stuff and go do work i'm just ready now gonna go grab myself a coffee i'm debating doing pilates simply because i was bending down i was making my bed and my hamstring just feels a little bit tight so i think i might just use today as like a full-on rest day and maybe go for a walk so i might get a coffee and walk instead of doing work and then i can go back and do some work but we're just going for an all black fit today i know very boring very simple and casual we were a little bit stressed there because i couldn't find my airpods but I found them so we're all good and we're just going to go grab a coffee now and I might be meeting my sister she's just awake so she might come meet me we are just on our way to Coles now I'm going to get some groceries for the week and then it's still only like 20 past eight so it's quite early in the morning but i'm gonna do a quick grocery shop mona's going to the gym and then i'm gonna go home and do some work i'm just back from my grocery shop so i'm gonna empty all my groceries and then i think i'm gonna make myself breakfast but this all came to just around 92 dollars it's 91.80 i got two of these salt caramel fiber ones they were on offer it was two for like nine dollars nine fifty got myself some eggs also i never actually used to look inside the eggs to see where they cracked or not until alan told me like you know obviously check the eggs so that's one thing that i started to do i got some like slimbos my frozen blueberries and also got frozen raspberries somewhere because they are elite on the overnight wheat mix bacon medallions the yo pro the salted caramel one and the vanilla one now this this used to be like six dollars and fifty cent and i think it's like 870 now which is like a two dollar increase which is crazy got a few tins of tuna for my lunch and my oats as i'm running low and then some unsweetened almond milk for like my weed mix then we also got the mini packets of this sweet and salty popcorn. I absolutely love this. Love it. It's so good. Got frozen raspberries. A packet. I couldn't remember how much rice and tuna for like my lunch. So I only just got one pack of rice because I felt like I had a good few. I got these turkey wrist rolls because I love the turkey burgers you could get at home in Ireland and Little. And I seen these and I was like, no, they're quite small like in comparison but i was thinking i might have these for dinner like on the nights we don't have training because that's when i make my own dinner so i am gonna try these now these could be horrible but look at i'm gonna try them and see how we go some mini packets of frozen veg this is the best thing ever i literally just bang it in the microwave for like three four minutes and it's great potatoes got some milk and that was my grocery shop so very simple like my oats for breakfast and then on like non-training days i'll have maybe like eggs and stuff for lunch and like make my own dinner or unless we got like leftovers from dinner with collingwood sometimes i have that and then on like training days i do have like the rice tuna and veg then dinner i have the turkey wrist rolls and um, i have weed bix i have the milk and all I kind of have the rest of the ingredients I need, so this will do me hopefully for the week. Very simple. I actually just put the biscoff straight into it, so I'm letting that kind of melt everywhere. And that is my breakfast. Quick outfit change. This is a new hoodie I got. This is my first time wearing it and I absolutely love it. 
It's one of the Anine Bing ones. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'm going to go meet my friends for our brunch now and I will catch you all later. This is the hoodie. I absolutely love it. But okay, I've got to go now. Bye. I'm just in the door for meeting the girls from brunch and now I'm going to get changed and I'm going to go down to the sauna and maybe do like a 10 minute sauna and then I might do some like recovery and stretching in the pool. I'm just going to finish the vlog here. I went to the sauna, showered and I've put on tan now so this is my fit for the evening. I am going to make myself dinner and just relax as we are training early in the morning. So I'm gonna finish this off here. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you soon. Bye.